Hi and welcome to this Fabricville tutorial. Today we are going to make this overall dress for girls. This model is timeless, with its central pockets and its adjustable straps. I made this model in denim fabric and I used a beige contrasting thread. To make this dress we will need the Burdestein 9356 pattern, a chalk, pins, scissors, a 12 cm zipper, 7 jeans buttons, two straps fasteners, some interfacing, fabric for the pocket pouches, fabric for the dress and thread. To start, I place the pieces of the pattern on the wrong side of the fabric, respecting the grain line. And I cut them out. I cut the pouches pieces in the printed fabric and I also cut the pieces of the belt in interfacing. Then I fused the belt. Then I transfer the notches of the pattern pieces before removing them from the fabric. The first step will be the hip yoke pockets. I lay the pocket pieces right sides together on the front of the skirt panel and I stitch the pocket openings. I trim the allowances and I clip the curves. Then I fold the pocket pieces to the back and I press. Then I top stitch two lines, one close to the edge and one 7mm from the edge. I pin the wrong side of the skirt front panel to the right side of the hip yoke piece, matching the notches, and I pin the pocket opening. Now on the wrong side I'm going to pin the pocket pieces to the hip yoke. And I stitch the pocket pouch contour without stitching the front. Next, I'm going to serge the front and back skirt edges. I lay the front skirt panel on top of the back skirt panel, right sides together. I pin the side seams and I stitch. On the left side, I only stitch from the notch to the bottom. I will baste the top to sew the zipper. I press the seam allowances open. Now I'm going to sew the zipper. You can watch our video about how to sew a zipper for more details. I can now sew the bottom hem. I fold the hem up 1.5 cm to the wrong side and I press. Then I stitch two lines. One close to the edge and one 7 mm from the edge. Now I lay the front waistband to the front skirt with the right sides facing. I stitch. Then I press the seam allowances upward, aiming toward the top. I will do the same for the back. Now I'm going to make the front bib, beginning with the front pocket. I press the upper edge of the pocket piece and I top stitch with two lines as I did previously. Then I press the remaining edges to the inside. I pin the pocket to the front bib according to the notches and I stitch with the same two lines. I pin the two flap pieces together, right sides facing, and I stitch these edges together. Then I trim the corners at an angle. Turn the flap right side out and I press. I top stitch the sides and serge the lower edge. Now, using the proper foot, I sew a buttonhole on the flap.
I pinned the flap above the pocket pointing upward. I stitch and I press the flap down. I'm going to make the straps. I fold them lengthwise, wide side facing in and I stitch. I trim the allowances. I turn the straps right side out. Press them. And I top stitch the edges of the straps with the same two lines. Now I lay the two front bibs right sides together and I'm going to stitch the edges together, leaving the bottom open. I do the same for the back bib pieces, except that I place the straps on the notches between the two layers. I trim the seam allowances, snip the curves, then I turn it right side out and I press. Next, I press the non-interface front waistband lower edge folded to the wrong side. I lay the front bib on the front skirt right sides together, lining the bib and the belt edges. Then I lay the non-interface belt piece right side facing down. And I stitch on the belt's contour. I trim the corners and the seam allowances. Then I turn right side out. Now I stitch two lines on the bib's edges. Then I edge stitch closely around the belt edges, catching the bib and the front skirt. I do the same for the back. It will be the same steps except that the belt will be longer to add the buttons. I can now lay the front ends of the straps around the bars of fasteners. I'm going now to sew buttonholes on the front, two at the bib sides and two at the belt sides. I'm going now to attach the jeans patterns. I insert the nail from the wrong side and place the nail in the button's back. Then I hammer in the nail. And I'm going to attach two buttons at the top, one on the pocket flap, two at the back bib sides and two at the back belt side. And our overall dress is ready. Thanks for watching.